What's up everybody, it's Ron Neri Jr. I'm here right now in West LA off Sawtelle Boulevard. And if you've been here before, you might be familiar with Be Sweet. Be Sweet's a Filipino dessert bar and the owner is Chef Barb. And guess what? Chef Barb decided to open up a Filipino comfort food restaurant called Big Boy, or as I like to call it, Big Boy! Thank you. Thank you All right. So much. Boom. It's a pork CC with rice. Okay. And I got the lechon kawali with the beef skewer. All right. Let's go. Make sure you get some rice in there. Woo! Mm. Hell yeah. Mmm. So this pork sisig, um, I could definitely taste the vinegary um, taste to it and, um, and the note just kind of creeps up on you and then hits you at the very end. And so you got this really good home style pork sisig. Try out this barbecue skewer now. Again, I'm doing this Filipino style with the hands. It wouldn't be right without it. Mmm. Okay. Give me a second, it's gonna take me a while to chew. Before I even ate it, like as I was about to put it in my mouth, um, I could already smell um, just the whole barbecue flavor. It almost, it almost tastes like, um, if you've ever had Korean jerky for, before, like Korean bar, um, barbecue jerky, which is delicious, tastes just like this, I would say. Um, but it also has like the Filipino like vibe to it. So you could tell that it's not Korean, that it's Filipino. Um, yeah. Hey, this is Tony and I uh, went in to try Big Boy today. I tried the uh, skewers, because I, I like beef skewers, so I tried the skewers. Uh, very tasty, very tender, very soft, along with the white rice. Uh, very delicious. That's just the first thing, more to come. And the flavor was, was good. It was, uh, it was juicy, it was moist. Mm -hmm. Juicy, is that, that the best term for it, I guess? Um, and it was soft and tender. I like skewers that are soft, kind of almost want me not kind of thing. So I like that. It wasn't hard or anything, it was just right. Haha, <laughs> I finally Big Boy. It's been a while since I've actually wanted it. I didn't realize it was going to be named Big Boy, but to honor my, my late father, I thought it was a great, great name for it. His real name is Angel or Angel, but there's always Tito Boy, Lola Boy. So I thought, what a great, great name. And my dad had a heart attack when he was 43 years old. So my mom had to change a lot of the recipes. And so we, we learned how to do it without sacrificing the flavor of things. I'm doing a little bit of an elevated, you know, leaner cuts of meat, not a lot of oil. We have chicken adobo, we have longanisa, we have pork sisig, we have tocino, we have pancit, garlic fried rice. And then my, one of my dad's favorites, you know, the carne norte, which is the canned corned beef that we, you know, we added the onions in it and potatoes. Um, yeah, just all of kind of the very traditional, very classic dishes is what we started with. And then we have lechon kawali as a special this month. So every month check in because there's going to be something a little bit different. We love our vegetarian friends because there is a lot of meats in, you know, in the Philippines. There's a lot of pork that, you know, a lot of pork dishes, a lot of beef dishes. So we wanted to make sure they could eat it too. So you've got your garlic fried rice and we've made the pancit so it's vegetarian. There is the, you know, you can add chicken to it. So if you want a little bit of protein in there, but it is veggie based. Um, they can also have the white rice. And then this, this month we have, for our seasonal veggies, we have sitao and calabasa, which is the Chinese long beans and a, a very delicious sweet yellow squash. All right, so I'm about to finish the rest of this. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to call out to Big Boy in West LA.